So, guess who I haven't recorded a run with yet? If you guessed the convict, you'd be right. Hey you guys, what's up? Robin X is here, and back with a brand new episode of Enter the Gungeon. <clears throat> Last we left off, we did a pilot run, if I remember correctly, and found a disintegrator, which was absolutely ridiculous. <laughs> And, uh, yeah, I've actually been doing some things in between episodes. I've actually done some side quests, all, all this sort of stuff. So, yeah. We're just going to head into the dungeon and start and start the episode proper, right? <coughs> Sorry, got a little something in my throat. Not fun, never fun. Okay, so the convict starting stuff, kind of garbage, if I'm honest. This only has five shots in it. And she also has this sawed-off shotgun, but this thing is not very powerful. So starting out, the convict is not a powerhouse. And how did I get out of that alive? I don't. I. I have no idea, but I'm not going to question it. Okay. Uh, just gonna. Yeah, the convict is not a powerhouse from the start. Like, say, the marine or. Uh, who else? The Hunter. The Hunter's actually pretty good from the start. But, like, in terms of starting equipment, I'd say the, the Convict has it the worst, but that doesn't make her a bad character by any means. It just makes her one of the weaker ones. Okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay. 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 We're, we're doing this? We're doing this. Uh... But, yeah. So, I apologize if my commentary is a little lacking today. I'm kind of tired. I have not been getting a whole lot of sleep lately, and it's pretty much entirely my fault. Okay, not entirely. I have a really bad sleep schedule right now, and then these, and then I've been having to wake up really early because of the painters that have been coming over. I'm moving soon, or soon-ish. The house is going to be put on the market soon, then we're going to move sometime in the fall. Good news is, the new house is going to be absolutely amazing. Bad news is... All this has, all this crazy stuff has to happen. Okay, then. You have to do that, my, my good man. Okay, I should talk about the convict's uh, gimmick. The convict's gimmick is that she deals more damage after taking damage. So, she's basically a berserker, I, I want to say. Is that, the, is that the right RPG archetype? You know, the one that, like... Become stronger and become like the kind of thing that like you know takes damage to deal significant damage. Kind of like the uh, kind of like Samson in Binding of Isaac, except it's not a stock upgrade to damage. It's just you know a temporary damage boost every time you take damage, which is an interesting little uh, concept, and it actually works in her favor. Unfortunately, boss is kind of make this... It, it's kind of like... It softens the blow of screwing up a no-hit run on a boss. Oh my gosh, this thing. I've actually already got this, um... I've actually already got this gun. Like, I haven't gotten it on a run, but... Suffice to say, it's... interesting. It's actually pretty powerful, though, so... Better than anything else I've got, so I'm gonna be using it. And the knockback on it is kind of stupid, if I'm to be perfectly honest. <clears throat> this is basically how you kill enemies that are near pits. You just shoot this at them. It's silly. But you know what? I like silly. I'm a silly person. I'm a silly kind of guy. That's just who I am. Deep inside. I don't even know where I'm going with any of this. I'm tired. Nothing makes sense to me. I'm probably going to be playing like garbage. Even though I have like... Like, I'm going to be playing like garbage. Probably. Because I'm so tired. I can't get my commentary in order. This is what happens. I almost didn't record this episode today. If, you, if you're wondering why this episode is so late, it's because I had no energy to record it with. And I only just now had like a caffeinated drink that gives me some some semblance of energy. <laughs> I am def I am glad I'm doing this though because I need to adhere to my schedule. Oh, oh mm -hmm. wait a minute! What? Hold on. 
Can I? Well, I just discovered I can do that. Interesting. But anyways, uh, I don't know what I want to do today. Uh, in terms of, like, what do I want to accomplish with this game, right? I'm thinking I want to try and make it to the forge and assemble and, and at least give the 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 uh, gunsmith I think her name is at least one or two pieces of the bullet that can kill the pass. So I'm gonna try to get the prime prime. Oh boy, this is my first boss. This is my first boss. This is my first boss. This guy. Oh my gosh. Oh well. Let's fight an unreasonably buff bird with a uh, with a t-shirt cannon. Why not, right? Making sense is for losers. Actually it does a reasonable amount of damage. To okay! Well, so much for the no hits. Okay, okay, okay. Just ring around the rosy, ring around the rosy. Acapulco, I don't know how to say that song anymore. It's been so long since I've sung it. It's like... It's like ashes, 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 we all fall down is somewhere in there, but it's about... And I, I know the first and the third verse. But that's about the extent of my knowledge on that childhood song. Where are you? There you are. Okay. Uh, dodge around, dodge around, dodge around, dodge around. Don't get hit by the giant missiles. That is very disadvantageous to my survival. And dodge, dodge, dodge. Okay. Survive that for Rye. Okay. We beat, we basically shot him. There's t-shirts everywhere. <laughs> oh, man, this game. Shotgun coffee. Speed up. Choke on that. Okay. Let's just head to the next floor, shall we? Ugh. Yeah, I'm, I'm, like I said, I'm really tired, so I'm playing like garbage, that's why. Funny thing is, I've actually no-hit the Gatling goal before. I was like... The, the conditions were... I was playing as the Marine, I had no weapons besides my Marine sidearm. And it was in a, it was in a Gatling Gold arena that had like a bunch of obstructions. Oh wait, I'm just, I, I just remembered. Oh whoa whoa. There we go. I can't believe this is an actual thing. Ah. The Berserker thing is really helping me. I mean, it's it's nice, but I don't want to have to rely on it, but I'm having to because this game is just kicking my butt because I have no sleep. Oh my gosh. Oh. <laughs> Today on things I don't think you quite understood wouldn't work. Everything about that. Okay. Uh, uh. Oh man, imagine if sleep deprived Robbie is it is funnier than fully awake and raring to go, Robbie. How did that not hit me? You are not allowed to do that, good sir. I'm killing ghosts with t-shirt cans. This is some Ghostbuster crap. Uh, uh. I think I've already made Ghostbuster jokes about these guys, actually. Like, episode one, I think? And in the Bosch recording of it. I think. Oh, whoa, what? Why is this room deemed okay? Are you quite done? This is all you're going to be spawning until... Ugh. That room was just straight up boring. 
Oh, what? Okay, mental note. Don't go through that room again. Yeah, uh... Thanks, but no thanks. I think I will be keeping my hearts. Uh... This is pretty nice, though. What I have to wonder is... It does seem to be based on per pellet. So does this mean that um, a shotgun is going to make better use of that item than any other weapon? Okay, let's get away from the ghost. I'm not afraid of no ghost! But, uh, at the same time, I don't exactly want to deal with them either. Oh, gosh, then, yep, I'm dead. I'm dead on the second floor. This is, uh, this is not good. We're gonna have enough... We're gonna either have, like, a short two-run video or a long two-run video. We're gonna have, like, another episode two. Let's not be so catastrophically garbage this time, shall we? He says, having no sleep and, and is blinking like crazy, and probably will go take a nap after this video is recorded and uploaded. <laughs> uh, okay. Okay, back off, back off, back off. Okay, okay, dodge into that, dodge into that. None of this has any business working, but okay, we're going to run with that. Okay, what determines whether those guys are going to explode or not? I don't understand. Is it just, is it literally just random chance, or is there something affecting them? Because I, I feel like it could be either or. I don't need that. I would. I, I could have used that on the last one, but mm, oh well. So that's just the nature of roguelikes, am I right? By the way, tell me if you guys don't mind me doing things in between episodes. I understand why some would mind, but at the same time, I don't want to just cater to one person out of like however many watch my videos. You know, I want to cater to the majority. Because that's the people who are going to care, if that makes any sense. I mean, not saying the minority doesn't matter. If you do, it's just, you know... I... Uh, I don't know what I'm... I don't know what I'm trying to say here. I'm probably coming off as kind of a jerk. Kind of a... You know... Just kind of coming off as a generally horrible person. But, you know... Don't take that to mean I don't care. And... Well, uh... I don't know whether to call this weapon awful or not. I mean, it looks like it just kind of goes all over the place, but that could work. Let's try it. Oh my word, it slaughters. Oh, it goes in a straight line. Ooh, interesting. So it seems to have some homing capabilities. Interesting. I'm gonna hold on to that. Budget Revolver is such an apt name. But actually. <laughs> Ugh. If, any said if anyone said bless you, then I greatly appreciate it. Okay, I feel like the, the like saying bless you to someone who has sneezed. Is starting to kind of go out of style, and that's kind of sad. It's kind of like a little common courtesy, don't what you think? I would think. Okay, well, did they just go for him? I, I, I'm not sure I fully understood what happened there, but okay. Ugh. Alright, so the boss room is here. I don't have a key, and I'm not going to visit the shop because I'm running on a budget. So let's go for it. 
Bullet King, yes, this I can deal with. Awesome. A lot of people say the Bullet King is hard. Watch me lose to him, by the way. Okay. Oh! Okay! Okay! Dang it! Uh, I'm not paying attention at all. There's fire everywhere. Whoa, what? I was actually kind of wondering if I could pick that up, but apparently not. Okay. Well, now that I've taken damage, I can actually make use of the Berserker mode. Okay. So... So we killed the Gatling Goal with the T-Shirt Cannon. And we killed the Bullet King with Paper Airplanes. Are we gonna... Is that a... That... I... I... Is this just the... Is this just the weapons that shouldn't work but do episode? I don't understand anything that's going on. I don't understand my life right now. I will hit you with my pillow of death! Okay, what do you want? Alright, he needs three of those. Okay. It... What? Why is this actually an effective weapon? I'm sorry, but why? I don't understand my life right now. I don't understand this game. What is this game? What is life? What is anything? I don't get it! Nothing makes any sense anymore. I swear, if I get like a... If I get to the forge... Because of a pillow... Because of something that is basically... A pillow gun... I am not sure what I'll think. I'll probably be this weird mix between salty and impressed. Oh boy, this is going to be one of those days, isn't it? <laughs> this is going to be one of those days where things are just kind of weird. We're, we are, as Vinny from Vine Sauce would say, getting very weird with it. And we are running out of ammo for our origami. Okay. Well, let's see what old shopkeep has for us. I need to screen cap that. That's, uh... Mm, mm, that's interesting. No power-ups for you. I love how she swings it, it swings it too. His aim is so bad. That must be because of the eye patch. Oh. He's down. Seriously, a shopkeeper that only sells. I don't understand anything right now. But I got a big iron. So you know what? I'm not going to complain about anything. Uh, you have nothing good for me, sir. Here's hoping I get a gate key. And 
That was how many? No, no, no. That was how many empty rooms in a row that didn't have any enemies in them? Okay, then. Weird. But I'll take it. Whoa, what is this room? It's, it's, this is a weird weapon. It looks like it should be like a Gatling gun. But it's a shotgun. I don't understand. I don't need health. Goodness gracious. You're being a Dumbo. Alright, what... What's... Ooh. Ooh, do I risk it. Ooh, do I risk it. You know what? We've gotten plenty of health this floor. Let's go for it. Okay. Okay. So yeah, in case you couldn't tell, this, uh, this shrine is a challenge room. It basically spawns a bunch of enemies, and if you kill them all, with multiple waves, and if you kill them all, you get a reward. Whoa! What the heck is this? Blank damage? Blank damage? Blank steel damage? This is all very confusing to me right now. Oh, either thing I need. Alright, so I'm gonna go here. Uh Um What? He's probably insulting my mother in an alien language. <laughs> okay, uh Go to the shop here. Uh, actually, no way. This would be more efficient. Okay. Alright. And then... We're going here. And the boss is probably this way. No? So far this has been an absolute murder machine. Not complaining about that in the slightest. Good grief. Sometimes I click once too many and, and shoot. I don't think this will be very good against the boss. Mainly because I want to use the big uh, the silencer. Because the silencer is freaking hysterical. I have this weird obsession with using funny weapons against bosses. There's just something inherently funny about it. Like, using a silly weapon to beat down a gigantic boss, you know? You regret your life decisions up to this point, sir, because I do think you should. Okay, is the boss through here? No. Where is this boss? Cry out loud. Well, good to have that, I guess. Okay. 
So the boss is down here, I guess. Alright, fair enough. Yep. Alright. Here we go. The holster, of course. You are my pain, but you know what? I'm gonna kick your butt with a pillow. That does very little damage to him. <laughs> she she puffs up the pillow to reload it. That's hilarious. I love the noise it makes. Casually killing a demon with a pillow. Welcome to enter the gungeon. Enjoy your stay. I got hit. Dang it. Oh well. Guess this is one of those runs where I just don't get health upgrades. But you know what? I killed him. I killed him with a pillow. I'm happy about this. What are you? Oh. 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 <laughs> I win? Yes. Okay, if I can survive... Uh, if I can survive through the hollow, I can get one of the pieces for the... Uh, wait a minute. I can get the arcane gunpowder with this. But then I'd have to... Never mind, then. Forget the... <gasps> okay, okay. Does it stun them if you hit them with that point-blank range? That's hilarious. So I'm literally hitting enemies with, pil with a pillow. <laughs> I love this game so much. It's like, I think I might be getting tired of this game, and then it throws stuff like this at me. Also, the fact that my blinks now deal damage to enemies is interesting. Okay. What just happened? Oh, I must have stepped to something and spent an armor piece. Which is basically a blank, so it dealt, da dealt damage to everything. Oh, come on! Not this! And you thought your gun was silenced. That was a bad one. I'm sorry, that was really bad. I don't think that even counted as a joke. I think that was just me making a dumb comment. And can you tell I'm trying to be funny? Yeah, no. The blanks are so interesting now, because, like, I can... <laughs> I'm smacking them in the face! This is great! I love this game! Oh. Yep, knew it! It is a freaking mimic! Okay, okay. Let's just run away. Okay, we got we got something from it. Blanks poison. So now my blanks can deal damage and poison enemies? Question mark. I don't know why anyone thought thought this was acceptable, but I'm not by no means complaining. <laughs> yeah. 
Okay. Those guys are really weak. Every time they poke their heads out, I just kill them instantly. <laughs> Even when I have, like, worse guns than this monstrosity. Goodbye! Okay, but I really could use some health right now. My, my odds are looking kind of bad right now. And if the boss is the Treadnought, then I am most definitely going to die. Okay. What's in here? Is it... Yep, it's just this guy. Blah, blah, blah. I wish I could take his sword. No, I'm not messing with that today. No, thank you. Whoa, what? What? <laughs> okay. Okay, that's funny. <laughs> oh, that was, uh... That was something. Goodbye. Okay, how much of this floor have I mapped out? Okay, everything down there, so... No, no. Okay, don't get hit. Well, yeah, not even going to deal with this room. Not even going to. Great. Well, down to the silencer. Oh, thank you. Oh, goodbye, dear sir. I'm still laughing about the junk thing. Oh my gosh, you're kidding me? He doesn't have anything I can use. Well, I mean, he has this. He has this. A blank. Okay. Well, I guess I'm going to have to essentially no-hit the boss if I want to win. Oh boy. This is not going to be a fun experience for anyone, but no, but you guys. And of course, it's the Treadnought. Well, this is better than the Cannon Balrog. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. It's a con it's it's a criminal versus the army. I'm not even going to bother with it, you know. And I'm using a pillow. <laughs> I think this episode wins points just for being stupid. I, I This entire game wins points for having the audacity to do this kind of thing. I am going to be shocked if I get through this. Really. Okay, okay, okay. I I... Okay, okay. No, 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 Take your pillows to the face, young man. Go to sleep. I mean, I probably need sleep more than you do, but go to sleep all the same. I just 
realize this game is probably sending me subtle hints that I have better things to do than than play this game. Oh, cover's gone. Uh, yeah. Okay, okay then. No, 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 no. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Go to bed, young man! I probably could have been making jokes like this all episode, but I only just started making them, like, probably near the end. Oh boy. Ooh. Come on. Okay. Okay. You know what? No. <laughs> okay. Well, I think I'm going to end off the episode here. If you guys enjoyed the episode, leave a like and leave a comment down below telling me what to do next. And also hit that subscribe button if you want to see more. Gungeon episodes come every Monday. No, 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 hold on. I'm getting, I'm getting my own schedule mixed up out of sleep deprivation. They come every Sunday, Wednesday, and no, Sunday, Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday. Cards Against Humanity is on every Monday. No, one Vid Wonders every Wednesday. And my plan was to have streams every Friday, but for now, that's a break day for me. So, thank you all so much for watching. And as always, stay sensational. Goodbye.